Take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction, let us show you the way. Coffee, tea and other caffeinated beverages are known to boost energy levels. However, they can also have the opposite effect by leading to rebound fatigue after the caffeine leaves your system. Point one four August 2017. Let's help you make your mark. Coffee itself won't instantly make you feel tired, but the caffeine it contains may actually lead to fatigue after regularly drinking it over time. If you stick to 400 mg of caffeine per day or less and go easy on the added sugar, you should reap the benefits of caffeine and avoid its drawbacks. Let's help you make your mark. Many of us can't imagine starting the day without a cup of coffee. One reason may be that it supplies us with a jolt of caffeine, a mild stimulant to the central nervous system that quickly boosts our alertness and energy levels. Let's help you make your mark. If drinking a cup of coffee makes a person feel tired, the effects of caffeine may be responsible. Caffeine increases alertness by interfering with certain chemical processes in the brain that regulate the sleep-wake cycle. However, once the body completely metabolizes caffeine, it can make people feel tired. 25 September 2019 Let's help you make your mark. Stein suggests that caffeine and ADHD may be related through their effects on sleep. Although their symptoms differ, he says, caffeine is a stimulant that affects sleep, and chronic sleep deprivation can cause inattention, and potentially could be ADHD. Take our lead. Folks who say caffeine does nothing to them probably do not have very sticky receptors. After joining up to your receptors, caffeine travels to your liver, where it's metabolized. Even if someone is a fast metabolizer of caffeine, they may still feel the effects more strongly if they don't drink it regularly. 0.6 July 2018. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.